your boy Striker at Crash FM. Now today, not tomorrow, I am now telling you why Mario Kart sucks. Firstly, Plumber Boy is scared of Crash Bandicoot and we can't even compare to him. Crash has so much more personality than that mustache man's kart game. Secondly, why the hell are there babies? Why are they even here? We could have characters that everyone loves. Diddy, Bowser Jr., Birdo, King Boo, and Dry Bones. But no, we get these stupid babies. Literally, nobody likes them. I'm specifically talking about Baby Daisy and Baby Rosalina Bloody Hell. Thirdly, why in the hell would every item in existence hit you and throw a fit, making you vulnerable to 50 more items headed your way? As if Sega made a better game than this bad game. Sell the game if you don't know your heads. Anyways, this has been Striker, signing off. Atomica here, and we here at Dread Zone News, and guess what? The villagers have a special report about something. Let us hear what they have to say. What? Oh, 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 yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ, now are we gonna listen to this report? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Boy. Look, I can get along with this crying from a crash junction. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Did he just speak Zulu? I've never heard someone from a village say this. <laughs> this guy is becoming a madman. Turn it off, striker, right now. Hi guys, here is some sad news. A purple dog died in a snowy explosion. I will send my condolences to that dog. You are listening to Crash FM. You watch the fight. This is not in her disoffice spam taking over Crash FM. Because the god of Microsoft Sam said so. Now you may be asking, what the hell happened to you, DJ Striker? Well, let us just say that he is currently on an extended holiday. Damn it, Sam. Get out of the reporting. Hey, right it's you, now. the Glutto. What the hell are you doing in my booth? You will never take him here alive. He's getting away, someone stop that glutton. The suspect, who has been identified as Mercury Sparks, is resisting his fine and is currently on the He was charged for eating too many pieces, which makes him a human. Joe Spider, host of Crash FM and Dread Zone FM, told Burnout Sparks that the suspect hacked the Crash FM game before him. For Burnout Sparks, and... Sons of God thought they could take me to prison. Just because I'm a glotto. Even though I am not. Screw that. I'm a goddamn glotto and I have powers on my side. Oh, look at me, you little bees. I am just trying to choose me. The goddamn bird is on stem. You can't do crap to me. Fossil. I'm going to eat it. It takes more than a single piece of crap to have to me. Your cars don't have a match against me. You'll never take me. Never. You are goddamn right I got away from you.
so close that we need more food to bring me for your craft. And now it's lobby, and you cannot catch me. You'll always escape from your grasp. But I even have a free jail card. They won't know that I stole it from those blacklist members. I gave you one simple task and you let him get away? How did you even screw this up? Hey, it's not my fault that he escaped. He just zipped past me and made me crash into another person's car. Well, you're lucky you are still alive. But we can't give up as there are a couple of men and women in our team. Sergeant Cross, what do you suggest? I want every single unit after the guy. Everyone. Everyone! Everyone! Okay, people, you heard it. We have no time to lose. It's your boy, Atomica, and what is going on here? Oh, that's right. It's Burnout. They are just remote controlled. By the way, I am going to explain why Burnout 3 Takedown is the best. Firstly, Takedown is arguably the most beloved game in the series, and it's easy to see why. The title took the series to a whole other level with its incredibly polished and exciting driving mechanics. Plus, the destructive aspect of the series is expanded upon in this one due to the debut of Takedowns. The ability to destroy your opponent's vehicles by smashing into them or pushing them into a wall helps separate this title and the Burnout series from the average racer. With the new mechanic comes the popular Road Rage mode, which is all about taking down other cars. This mode, along with the improvements to Crash and World Tour, make this the best title the series has produced. In fact, it's among the greatest ever arcade racers in general. Hold on, you say Burnout 3 Takedown is the best? Finally. You finally admitted Burnout Paradise sucks. Hell, I feel sorry for Paradise. If it had Crash Mode instead of Showtime, it would have been close to my game. So is this the Xbox 360 of Burnout Revenge? No, Striker, I never said that Paradise sucks. Oh boy, people are killing each other here. I think that Crash Mode is one of the best game modes so far, if I am not mistaken. I agree with you, DJ Striker. Hi guys, Striker from Crash FM and I have good news. The glutton has finally been captured. Now how is this possible? Well, someone named Cross hit him with a helicopter. Also, he's going to appear in court next week. Let's hope he's put into justice. Hey, peeps! I and Stryker, we are discussing a new potential burnout game. Oh, and I found something. What is it, Atomic? Crimmins did express interest in making a new title, claiming that the studio holds the most passion for Need for Speed and Burnout. This means we might getting a burnout game in the near future. Atomic, did you just see what he did? A vertical takedown, which is amazing. Great. Maybe we should put hope for this to happen. However, there is a company named Three Fields Entertainment that does burnout. They made Burnout Dangerous Driving two years ago. Now they are making Burnout. Reacation coming this year. My question to EA is that if they made Burnout Dominator, why can't they make another one? Simple. They want money and they think Burnout is too dangerous for kids. No, money isn't important for them. It's what the players and the fans made them legendary. Not some EA that is rotten. For the second one, Jesus Christ, Min and Ale played Burnout 3, Burnout Revenge, Burnout Dominator, and Burnout Paradise. They are saying this. They should have to three fields entertainment. True Atomica, do you like Silver Lake or Sunshine Keys? I would prefer Sunshine Keys due to its neon city and it is so popular. I will visit to it one day. I can take you there now. I will buy two tickets for each of us. Well guys, we are moving from USA to Sunshine Keys. Okay, this has been Atomica at Crash FM, signing off. This is Stryker and you've been listening to Crash FM. Meanwhile when Microsoft Sam was arrested by the police. No. Yes, I finally he got arrested. Make him shut up. I will be out. You dare, son, and you will see. There he is. After him. Bob, look, I pushed him now. Maybe. Gotcha. I found him, boys. Great work, Sam. <laughs> oh, man.
Did you pick the wrong street to run on? No, I didn't. Sit down! How you been? It's time to settle a little score from Rock.